there was a lot of negotiations went on. Uh, but I think one thing that we did see was a lot of class from our captain, and he really did lead from the front on this. And I know I've, I've already said this, but I'm going to repeat it. Uh, he showed a lot of class, a lot of empathy, and a lot of real good leadership skills to get the players to this point, to help get to the players to this point. And equally, you know, I mean, the way he looked after the staff as well. You know, I mean, he spoke about the staff in there. And I think what it has done is he's galvanised his position as a leader. Um, all the boys have recognised that, all my staff have recognised that. And I think what it's done is it's, it's made us all pull in behind him. And no, Ben Stokes, have you spoken to him? How is he? And is there any chance he could join up later in the Ashes tour? Uh, listen, you know, I mean, Ben is moving forward. Uh, the communications I've had with him, you know, I mean, he's definitely more upbeat. But what I will say is there'll be no pressure from me for him to rush back. And when he's ready, I've said, when you're ready, you call me and we'll make a plan from there. So obviously there's, there's no pressure from my, my end and we'll put no dates on it. But it's a possibility. Listen, there's no pressure from me. I'm not going to tell him when he needs to be back. I'll be led by him. And obviously my first and foremost concern is his well-being. And when he does come back to make sure he's in the right place.